YouTube, 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 welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlogs. It's your boy DIY Kari coming at y'all with another video. Shout out to everybody that's been watching the video. Shout out to everybody that's new to the channel. If you're new to the channel, on the channel, this your boy DIY Kari, aka Kari. I do reps, UAs, Nike pickup vlogs, and all the above. So welcome to the channel everyone that has subscribed i really appreciate it today we got a ua shoe that does not release a 2025 but before i get into the shoe as y'all know i gotta get this out the way this is an informational video this is my opinion only i'm merely teaching myself and y'all at the same exact time uh what i like about these shoes and what it's possible to come with new shoes before they even release. So with that being said, let's get straight into the video. This shoe today came from my good people over at shoepop.ru. That's gonna be their website, Instagram, WhatsApp, and my code DIY to save yourself. $15 off your entire purchase if you decide to shop with them or if you just decide to go look at a channel you got the information right there and it will be in the description below just so you can check them out while y'all watching the video without further ado let's just get straight to the shoes like I said this one does not come out to 2025 it, it is going to be part of the pink pack from Travis Scott himself this is gonna be the shoe this is shy pink if y'all been watching the channel y'all know i already did the dark pony and i did another pink travis scott that does not release till 2025 but this one in particular i actually love the color blocking on this one with the pink and brown. Right off the bat, y'all see that Sicko Mode logo at the back of the shoe. You got that infamous reverse Nike check with the buttery suede, as you see, touching, rubbing. It does move. Same thing with the toe box. Then you got the pink Nike check logo and you got that Cactus Jack logo. And I pointed out every single Travis Scott shoe. This spacing is essentially different on every shoe. Don't know why, don't know if that was a mistake or if it's done on purpose, but it's on every shoe. Just so y'all can see that has the gap. I've had some that has no gap. That is just how they're made. But moving on to the laces, as you see, it comes with two separate laces, it comes with a brown, and it comes with that pink, and the laces that are inside the shoe, it's gonna be that cell colorway. I'm hoping that these are not super long, but they do look super long. Can't, even, can't really do nothing about that, hopefully, these aren't long also, but it is what it is. We got that Cactus Jack going through the regular Nike check, cell colorway on the outsole. And the leather going around the suede is gonna be that tumble leather, crisp tumble leather. Does bounce back just so y'all can see. And one thing I've been pointing out of every shoe I get from a different company is if it has a smell or if it has glue lines. This one has no glue lines. Let y'all see for y'all self. And it has no smell. I did not have to let this one sit outside. I did not have to do nothing special to get rid of the smell. 
but just giving y'all a once around to show that there's no glue lines going from the outsole to the upper. And on this one, as y'all can see, they got the Air Jordan logo, Wings logo that is. Let me show y'all the insoles because they are different for each shoe. Got this one with Travis Scott, Nike Air, and that Sicko Mode logo. This one got the Wings logo, Cat's Jack, and the Air Jordan logo. And there's nothing special, just regular foam insoles. Comes in every Jordan 1 shoe, so you got the inserts that come with them with the Jordan logos on them. Box. This one did get a little dinged up, but as y'all know, comes a long way, so I can't expect perfection. They did bubble wrap it, it did get double box, but hey, it's still gonna happen. This is my size, size 10. Just so y'all can see the color. White, light, khaki, black. Again, this box has came with every Travis Scott that I've gotten so far. They always have the pink paper. It's a white paper. So nothing new there. It does have that sticker. And as you see, it came with some moist protectors. Protection from moisture. But all in all, definitely a great shoe from Shoe Pop. As always, have not had no issues with any of the shoes I got from them. And I've gotten quite a few. So this just adds to that where they have never let me down whatsoever. Y'all got any questions? Just hit the comments below. Interact with me. Let me know what y'all thinking about these. Let me know y'all got, have gotten shoes from there or have had any issues. I really wanna know. But that is gonna be my review on the Shy Pink Retro One Travis Scott Lowe's. Again, thank you everybody from been, that's been watching, subscribing to the channel. Really appreciate y'all. Keep liking, keep watching, keep subscribing. It definitely helps. And interact with me, like the video, do what you gotta do. Keep helping me grow. Really appreciate it. It's your boy DIY Kari signing out. Peace.